Delta 7.5 purchases in foreign currency. So for this task, we are going to record the purchases. So first, we need to record the first instruction. We need to record purchase invoice. So we need to go to the uh, purchase invoice. So I click on supplier and then I choose purchase invoice. So here and then create a new one. So the creditor is supplier for okay and then for the PI number I follow the uh, system numbering so I key in the supplier DO number which is 1223 supplier invoice number 1223 as well okay and then the date is on 8th of January after that, I insert the item code. So the item code is PHS, PHL001. Okay, and then the quantity is 2. Okay, so after that, what you can see is you can see the currency rate there is USD with the 3.5. So the local total is 3500. Okay. After you done this, you just click OK. To sorry, you just click save and we proceed to the second uh, instruction which is we need to click on the sorry, we need to create the AP invoice. So I go to the AP invoice so we don't have here AP invoice create a new AP invoice so the creditor is supplier for general type purchase and the currency is USD so I key in the supplier info the invoice number 1234 and then the invoice number here remain the system 1 so the date is 9th of January and the purchase account is 610. Okay, and the amount of the yeah, the amount of the transaction is 1100. Okay, so in USD is 1100. So when you convert, the local net total will be 3850. Okay, so if let's say you want to view the posting details, you click on view and view posting details. So you can actually see that this amount 1,100 credit into the supplier account, debit into the purchases. Okay, but at the same time, after convert, it will be 3850. Okay, so this one I close and I only have one AP invoice so I untick after save I click save button okay so the next instruction is journal of transaction report so now I want to show you the journal of the transaction before the payment so we have to go to the uh, GL and after that we can actually see the journal of transaction report so here you need to assign the date from 1st of January until 31st of January so we don't choose any filter we just click inquiry so here you can see the home debit and credit amount but for the original uh, amount and also the currency code what you can do you can uh, right click at the uh, header and then choose the column chooser and you can actually choose the original amount of credit and debit so you just double click here and then for the debit also double click it will go to the uh, top so for the currency code you double click as well and I close for the customization box there okay and then I can see there is a, a home 
amount and also the original amount with the currency code. So that's how you uh, view your journal of transaction report. So after that, I close from here and close from the AP invoice as well because the next instruction, we need to record the AP payment. So uh, we click on the shortcuts uh, here, AP payment, create a new one. And then uh, for the creditor, we pay to the supplier for Okay, and then you can see the currency is USD. USD to MYR is 3.5. So here you need to change the uh, currency to 6. Point, uh, sorry, 3.6 manually. Okay, so pay to supplier D and then the PV number follow the system. You have to change the date to 10 of January. So the description here. Uh, is for the payment so you can just put the payment okay and then the payment method is pbbpj so you choose pbbpj and then the amount is 1000 so after you put in the local sorry the amount 1000 you can see uh, the local amount is about 3005 sorry 3000 uh, 3.6 okay 3600 okay so after that what you can you need to not off not off invoice 1 2 2 3 so you tick here and then you click on save okay do you want to enter check number no we don't have any check number okay so it says that you need to set the uh, foreign exchange kin loss posting then you just click ok alright and after that you can see go back to the GL uh, journal of transaction report ok the same one so you click inquiry and if just now I go to the column chooser original credit and debit ok and then currency code Okay, I can see that the uh, payment that I already made just now, which is this one, loss of sorry, loss on foreign exchange, which is one hundred. Uh, so th this is how you actually uh, check on your uh, journal of transaction for the report. So I can close from this one and go back to the home page.